thank you for watching. The uh, purpose of this video is to show you how to assign points to assignments or warm-ups, quizzes, whatever you got going on in Google Classroom. How to assign points and then how does the gradebook portion of uh, Google Classroom work. So when you're creating an assignment, I'll just create a uh, new one right now. Let's just say I'm creating an assignment. Um, this is where the assignment title would go. Instructions would go here, whatever your instructions um, are, would go here. And you always have these options down here. I'll just assign uh, digital task cards. I'll just assign that so I have something there. All right, so the important piece of this video is the points part. Let's just say I want to make this worth 100 points. If you don't want 100, you can choose whatever you want. Let's just say it's worth 10 points. It doesn't matter to me. Um, let's just say for me, I'll do 20 points. All right. Choose what topic you want it to go under. For me personally, I would put something like this under projects and change my due date. Doesn't really matter to me um, for the, the sake of this video. Um, the key here is the points. So if you ever want to assign points to a uh, assignment, this is where you need to do it when you're assigning it. Click assign. Let's just say you want to change that. You know, some time's gone by. Um, for example, recently I did a warm up. Let's say, oh, whoops, actually I wanted that to be worth some some other points. You can always edit. And you can change this. It says ungraded, but I could easily erase that and change it to 10 points. And now it's worth 10 points. So you can always um, do this when creating uh, an assignment, a question. You can also do this when you're editing it either way. And so that's how you set up a um, anything, an assignment, a project, whatever it is, to be worth points in Google Classroom. As far as the, the grading piece goes, which I personally do not do, I don't use it, but I can show you what it does look like. Um, recently here I have a quiz that uh, one person turned in. And so when I go to the assignment that I'm looking to grade, I can click on turned in. And then over here you'll see out of whatever, whatever you made the points out of. So this one I made out of 100. And so um, I could do grading, essentially look at the person's work, see, okay, what grade did this person earn? In this case, let's just say that the student earned a 73%. You just click here, 73 out of 100. If it was out of 20 points, you know, how many points did they earn, et cetera, et cetera. So I'll show you this again. We'll go back, um, let's see, uh, I'll go the wrong way. That's all right, though. Let's just say uh, I wanted to uh, grade the exit ticket for the day. Exit ticket turned in, and I just give everybody 100% for participation, uh, whatever it may be. Um, so you click here, 10 out of 10. And there you go. There are some shortcuts you can also learn for how to um, enter more than one at a time and you can return assignments to people and it's a little more advanced um, this just should get you going with it um, if you have any questions feel free to shoot them my way thanks